The main thing is that you should ask yourself what it is that is making me not to access what I want. What is it that is making me to, to be hindered? What is the stumbling block from my desires? beautiful people and welcome back to let's unfold with lefati family welcome back if you are new here you are welcome i am lefati kennedy and this is a channel where we share faith-based content model and christian lifestyle vlogs i am sure that is what you are similarly interested in before getting any further with this video let's make it official subscribe for this channel click on the notification bell so that you get notified whenever i pop in new videos subscribe 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 welcome 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 get a glass of your breath and let's dive on to today's topic on today's video we are going to be talking about the fruit of god spring before getting any further i lately i released a video about things that God pruned in my life. So I will link it down on the de description box so that you go and watch it and be driven to allow God to prune you. Let's get on today's nibbles. We are going to be reading from the book of John chapter 15 verse 2. It says, Jesus says, every branch in me that does not bear fruit he takes away and every branch that continues to bear fruit he prunes so that it will bear more fruit pruning is vitally important for us to grow in our walk with god we find ourselves in stagnation we find ourselves in confusion we find ourselves in discouragement but what is it that is birthing those things that are hindering us or stopping us from achieving or accessing our heart's desires or the will of God in our lives? It is impurities. Everyone needs God's purification. Everyone needs to allow him self to be pruned by the lord everything that is unrighteous and pure will keep us away from god will keep us from our blessings breakthrough healing deliverance marriage in short i am saying you need to be pruned by the lord the pruning of the lord is it's attached to the preparation of the things that you need to be accessing, the growth, the elevation that you need to be accessing in your walk with God. Impurities leads to inactiveness. And there are things that we need to throw away in who we are, in our habits. We need God to purify our thoughts. We need God to purify our motives. We need God to work in our character, in who we are, in how we act. God cuts away the bed to help us thrive and make good fruits through kind actions and positive changes in our lives. Hebrews chapter 12 verse 10 it says they disciplined us for a little while as they thought best but God disciplines us for our good in order that we may sh share in his holiness no discipline seems pleasant at the time but painful it is not easy to walk in your season of pruning or to allow God to 
prune you because it can be a relationship that God wants to cut in your life. It can be a job that God wants to cut in your life. Anything that God might find impure in, a li in your life and resisting his will to be done in your life. As you allow God to prune you, you are saying you want peace. You want joy, you want elevation, you want abundance, you want protection. Because those things that he is pruning in your life can be a hinderer of your success. So from today, make it your, make it your main aim to make sure that you allow God to prune you. You allow God to mold you in a way or in a shape that he wants you to be in. It takes being pruned to get to another level. It takes you being pruned to be able to sustain that blessing. It takes you to be pruned to know your purpose our thoughts our past is what god wants to clear out of our lives you cannot be able to receive when you are still clinging on to that branch that that is unforgiving that branch that is wasting money that branch that influences others to do bad. How do we expect God to use us? How do we expect us to, 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 to experience God's glory if we are impure? Impurities, just like in science, you know, impurities can cause a lot of effects, can cause... Um, Sm slow reactions can cause uh, uh, damages. So let's allow God to prune you. Do not forget to watch the video about things that God pruned in my life that you may be motivated to allow yourself to be pruned by the Lord. Going around with the branches that needs to be pruned it's it's a burden it's a lot of work it's a lot of confusion so allow god to pray you allow god to to release that thing that is hindering you from your success thank you thank you so much for viewing this video I did not intend to make it any longer. Please do make sure that you click the link on the description box and watch my previous videos about the things that God pruned in my life. I love you family, stay blessed. And if you are new here, please do remember to subscribe for this channel because I believe that there is growth for everyone. Even me, as you keep watching, I am growing. Okay, I am impacting my life through these videos. Thank you, thank you so much.